It's fun to add video effects to your movie. On the task list, click View Video Effects to see the video effects that come with Movie Maker. By the way, I have to shrink this window for the tutorial, but on your screen, the window will be much bigger and this pane will show more effects at one time. To preview what the video effects does, simply double click on it. Let's also preview fade in from white. So you see, you have a bunch of video effects to choose from. But I'll be honest with you. I have used Movie Maker for many years and I mostly just use four of these video effects. I like to use ease in and ease out with still pictures. I have three pictures here on my timeline and this is what they look like without video effects. Now I'm going to add video effects to them. I click the ease in video effect, hold the mouse down and drag it to the picture. I like to alternate between ease in and ease out. Now let's see what it looks like with the video effects. Didn't you like it better with the video effects? Another video effect I like to use is the slow down. It gives a slow motion kind of effect. Let me demonstrate that. I click on the slow down video effect and drag it down to the video clip that I want to add the slow motion to. Before I let go of my mouse, note the length of the video clip. I let go of my mouse to add the video effect and note how the length of the video clip doubles because everything moves slower now. Let's preview the video with the video effect. How can you tell if a video effect has been added to a clip? This is the telltale sign, this star right here. Right click on the clip, click video effects, and you can see what was added. You can also remove video effects and add other video effects. Last word of advice, go easy on video effects. They're only striking if you do it sparingly. And nothing smells more amateurish than a movie with too many senseless video effects.